Hey, what's up everybody? Frank Slauson here. I'm just kind of enjoying a ice cold Pepsi. 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 Choice of a new generation, you know. According to people like Michael Jackson, Michael J. Fox, Ray Charles, and anybody else who's ever done a Pepsi commercial. <laughs> Oh, I love pop. Well, you know, or soda or whatever it's called. It's it's a pretty good drink. Uh, couldn't have it every day, obviously, but, you know, that's why I just got to mix it up a little bit. <laughs> well, today we're going to talk a little bit about, uh, we're going to talk about the childhood stars. And, you know, because yesterday I was hanging out with my friend John, I never got a chance to make that video that we're making today. Which, we made a video yesterday, but just, you know... John kind of, you know, he, I didn't tell him that I was going to have bring the camera with. I kind of just kind of surprised him a little bit. You could kind of tell because he asked him kind of questions like, what is it? You know, like, you know, all this stuff. But he's a fun guy. He, you know, he's a little older than I am. But, you know, I have a lot of friends who are older like that, who are in their 50s or whatever, or older or younger or whatever, that, you know, it's just fun to hang out with, you know, that people I like to look up to, you know. I think that are great people and, you know. Yeah, <laughs> just works that way. So, anyway, so that's why yesterday's video was kind of short. But today, we're simply going to talk about childhood stars, and and I'm not talking about people like Michael or Macaulay Culkin or uh, Jason Bateman or you know people that are like uh, J Jaheel White, you know, who played Urkel, Steve Urkel in Family Matters, because we kind of know where those guys, you know, where they are. Are but I'm talking about people like. Uh, well, Jonathan Taylor Thomas, you know, where did he ever go? I mean, I used to be a big JTT fan. And, you know, I got made fun of a lot, too, just because, you know, I really was a fan of his work. And everybody who uh, <laughs> who knew that I liked Jonathan Taylor Thomas, you know, kind of made fun of me because it's like, well, he's the same age, or he's older than you by maybe a, a year, maybe two years. And yet... Uh, you, you, uh, you know, you, you're a big fan of his or whatever. Well, I just like the fact that he, you know, he was a good actor. I mean, he, he, uh, Home Improvement, you know, was a good show and it made him a, a huge star back in the 90s. And, you know, and then slowly but surely he, uh, eventually disappeared. Uh, and I don't know what happened. He made a few other movies and he made a few appearances, you know, on, uh, Smallville and, uh, my, uh, that other one, that uh, Monica Mars show or whatever that show is called, uh, Veronica Mars. Yeah, I don't know why I said Monica Mars, but anyway, Veronica Mars. And this is like back into like 2003, 2004, maybe 2005, and then he disappeared. You know, I uh, don't know what he's up to now. Don't know if he has kids or you know or family or you know what what he's doing. Working at McDonald's. I don't. I mean, you don't know. Uh, another thing I was going to ask or what I mentioned about childhood stars or whatever. Like the kid who, uh, well, he's not a kid no more, but uh, who played uh, Junior Healy in Problem Child. The Problem Child, or one or two anyway. He didn't play, uh, he wasn't in uh, Problem Child 3. That was somebody else that made for TV movie. But uh, whatever happened to Junior Healy? As far as I know, I saw him on YouTube here uh, that he, made, he had an account on YouTube. I don't know if he still does or not. Uh, I, I see. I, I forgot the guy's name. I don't have it. You know, I don't know it by heart. You know, which I should. You know, it's kind of a shame that I never looked it up before I talked about this. But uh, you know, I mean, what's he up to? You know, besides doing stuff on YouTube. You know what? What you know? After he uh, kind of dissolved as a child star, uh, you know, when he was a kid. You know, what did he do in his? You know, in his uh, the rest of his uh, youth youth days or whatever you know I'm sure he went to college I think he went to college for for film or something but I don't know you know I just don't know you know just those pondering questions I guess uh, and then like I was mentioning the the, the kids uh, the, the, I thought it was just one kid that played Oscar in the Ghostbusters 2 but it was actually it was two two uh, twin boys or whatnot at the time who are now who would be now about 20 or maybe 21 by now uh, according to when they made the movie, uh, he, this was in 89 or 88, 89, 
So I'm sure that the little baby was probably maybe one years old at the time, maybe. And you know, it was twin. It was uh, twin boys or whatnot. You know who I'm talking about. If anybody has any idea who these people are, you know, who, well, we know who the people are. But if they, if you guys know what they're up to, or whatever, have pictures or whatever, I'd like to see them. You know. Uh, then lastly, uh, the kids who play, who were in Look Who's Talking, who played Mikey, especially the one who played the older Mikey, you know, not uh, David Gallagher, you know, who played Mikey in the last Look Who's, Talk Look Who's Talking Now film, but I'm talking like the first Look Who's Talking film, you know, the, the very first one, the, the, the oldest kid who was on there who was Mikey, I don't, you know, I'm sure, I, see that movie was made like in 1990 or released in 1990. Or 8990, around the same time as Ghostbusters 2. And I'm sure that kid was at least two years old, maybe, maybe two and a half. I'm sure by now he's maybe, well, he's well over 20 years old by now. Uh, maybe 21, 22, maybe 23 right now. I try to look these get people up on, on YouTube, or on, not YouTube, but like Wikipedia and all that. Couldn't really find anything. And uh, so, yeah. Uh, what I want to know from you guys is what childhood stars did you guys grow up uh, idolizing or whatnot? And have they disappeared or are they still doing films and whatnot? Uh, let me know. So thank you for uh, watching this short little video. Uh, I don't know what we're going to be doing this whole week, but uh, I guess you just got to stay tuned to find out. I think what I'm probably going to do tomorrow is show you guys the DVDs that I got this past weekend here. Because I was going to do that too. And I know there's some that will actually want to see what I got. I got a lot, you know. And I even got that new Elimination Chamber DVD. But I will show you guys all that stuff and more tomorrow for another great adventure of the Frankie Slots Show Daily Summer Vlogs right here on YouTube.com.